Well, candidates for governor are counting on East Tennessee to push them over the finish line tomorrow. We're on the eve of Election Day. Three Republican candidates spending their last full day on the campaign in our area today. That says a lot. Mm -hmm. We wanted to know how much weight do voters in our region carry. Well, we took six of our surrounding counties. Uh, if you add up the votes in just the Republican primary in 2009 when Governor Haslam was running to be the nominee, these six counties, Anderson, Blunt, Knox, Loudoun, Roan, and Sevier, they make up more than 15% of the total statewide votes. Well, from your local election headquarters, everyone, WATE 6 on your side reporter Blake Stevens speaking to two candidates in town today. So, Blake, do they feel confident about support for them here in our neck of the woods? Hey, Kristen. Hey, Lori. Both Randy Boyd and Diane Black believe they'll do well in East Tennessee tomorrow night. Now, as you know, Commissioner Randy Boyd is from East Tennessee. He's a business owner, a boss, and just a familiar face in this part of the state. Now, Diane Black tells me she has an army of volunteers who have knocked on half a million doors in the state and made more than 300,000 phone calls. Now, we wait and see. While they celebrate their campaign that's coming to an end, Congressman Diane Black also focusing on the work ahead. If we do our work today with the telephone calls that we're making and the doors that we're knocking, that we're going to have folks who are undecided hear the message and they'll go to the polls tomorrow and they'll vote for Diane Black. Taking a moment to thank her supporters and staff, but Black also making a case for why her time as a nurse and time in Congress would make her a good governor. And I can tell you, I will be a governor who makes sure that we keep our traditional values and we stay who we are in the state of Tennessee. Commissioner Randy Boyd finishing up his campaign on home turf at this popular burger place in Sevier County. He believes he will be East Tennessee's choice and hopes to be the entire state's Republican nominee. I'm the only candidate from East Tennessee. I was born and raised in Knoxville. I own the Tennessee Smokies here in Sevier County. Uh, where we're at now. So we've got a lot of business interests, a lot of friends, a lot of uh, history in this part of the state. And um, I think people like having a governor that represents them from their part of the state. We're going to do really, really well in East Tennessee. While supporters of all ages waited to shake his hand, Boyd reminding them the race isn't over yet. We win that tomorrow, and then we start quarter two, which is winning the general election. we got to beat Carl Dean in the general. Well, as you may know, Black has received the endorsement of the uh, National Rifle Association and the endorsement of Vice President Mike Pence. Now, her connections in D.C. are one of the many things Boyd and, and their other opponents have criticized her for. Boyd says he isn't a career politician and is the outsider in this race. And guys, I, sus I suspect tomorrow cannot come fast enough for these candidates and, of course, for our viewers at home, too. Yeah, that's true. I think we're all excited about it. It's going yeah. to be quite the evening. Thank you so much, Blake. And we mentioned three candidates along with Boyd and Black. Bill Lee, also in our area. Yeah, his event is underway right now, everyone. And we do have a crew covering that right now. We'll show you his pitch to local voters coming up tonight at 11 o'clock. And of course, everyone, as your local election headquarters, we are planning coverage from before the polls opened all the way to when the last numbers come in. We're going to be talking with voters, the candidates, keeping you up to speed on air and online. So stay with us throughout Election Day tomorrow. We have lots of resources as well to get you ready for the polls. If you haven't voted yet, post it at WATE.com under the As Seen on WATE section. So be sure to check those out before you head out.